The Hero Star Destroyer is a cruiser class with a role as Disabler. They're purchasable by the Imperial Remnant starting at Tech Level 2 for 14,000 credits on planets with an Imperial Dockyard Warship Extension. When deployed to the battlefield, the Hero Star Destroyer has the following loadout taken word from word from the descriptions of Awakening of the Rebellion. They have average charging balance shields with a strength of 10,000. Balance shields don't reduce or increase the damage taken from any weapon type and can deal with most attacking units rather well. They have a whole strength of 14,000 with heavy armor. Heavy armor protects against every weapon type except heavy turbo lasers and other heavy weapons. They take a lot of additional damage from anti-armor weapons, making it very vulnerable to proton torpedoes and composite beams. They have a speed of 250 with an average acceleration and a low turn. Their sensor range is 4,000 with a max weapon range of 4,000 and an ideal weapon range of 2,500. The Hero Star Destroyer's weapon systems include the following. Two medium dual turbo lasers. Medium turbo lasers do full damage against medium armor but lose damage against heavy. They are most effective and accurate against cruisers and capital ships. Two two burst magpulse missiles. Magpulse missiles are anti-ship missiles used to reduce the fire rate of hit targets. Two three burst plasma missiles. Plasma missiles are used to take out shields, causing massive shield damage while also being fairly accurate even against frigates. Four light dual turbo lasers. Light turbo lasers do their full damage against light armor, but lose damage against medium and heavy. They are the most accurate turbo laser, being able to effectively shoot at frigates and everything bigger. Four repeating point defense lasers. Point defense lasers are very accurate, but cause little damage and have limited range. The repeating effect causes hit fighters' fire rates to be reduced by 50% for 5 seconds. The light turbo lasers and point defense lasers are not targetable hard points and are only destroyed once the ship is. They have a hangar bay that holds one Howl Runner squadron with one in reserve. Heroes come with a tractor beam and a fire mag pulse ability that severely lowers the fire rate of hit targets. With all that being said, the Hero Star Destroyer is a very effective shield disabler and large ship debuffer. Very few ships have the Magpulse Missile ability, making this ship very unique. Outside of the two missiles, I found the weapon systems on this ship to be relatively weak. The point defense guns are great, but this is certainly an escort ship to weaken enemies for your other ISDs. To maximize the Star Destroyer, use it against large enemy capital ships, and micromanage it switching its targeting from ship to ship once their shields are down. The unfortunate part about this ship, it is only obtainable through mission rewards or as the Imperial Remnant. The Hero Star Destroyer can be very effective when maximized through micromanaging.